Hey everybody, LB. Sugar. And Osborne. Bringing you the, I hope to god this is the final game of the tournament of Fade and Exo Blue Dragon. Blue spawning up in the top left. Fade spawning down here in the bottom right. Bottom left. Left. Bottom left. I'm tired. Shut up. We've been doing Bomb. this for almost three hours. Yeah. It's been it's been pretty long. <sighs> Deep. But um, for the week. we are on Circuit Breaker again. I, I honestly don't know what's what's with this map. This mod has tons of maps. Pretty much any Brood War map you could ever want. And we've seen, what, six games now on Circuit Breaker? Something yeah. like that. It was supposed to be the first match, so the first match is map, so it's going to be in there in a best of three no matter what. But, yep. Blue, you keep losing on this map. You know exactly that this map is not good for you. Why? Why don't you I think you he's going to be disappointed when they find that uh, they're in the same uh, positions as last time, only on the left side. Exactly. It's basically the exact same matchup we saw a minute ago, except Blue swapped Terran, which I do like more because his ZV, his TVZ is a lot better than his PVZ. In fact, his Zerg just sucks. In Brood War 2, does that still apply? <laughs> yeah, I'm not. I'm not sure about that. I feel like I could play any race in Brood War and suck evenly. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Uh, StarCraft to you. My, I, I know what my strengths and weaknesses are. I've played Brood War so much. It was the f first PC game I ever played. The only thing I didn't do is play Battle.net because... Because fuck Battle.net. At, at, <laughs> like, at like seven or eight years old when I started playing, I didn't even know it existed. Because my... Also, fade? map packs suck. Yes. Yes. yes fade getting an earlier hatchery this time around he uh he went for the hatchery first and then the spawning pool both uh, about three drones earlier than last time so we'll see uh what he plans to do with that quick bunker but, uh, going up for blue up here making sure that any zerglings are going to have a bitch of a time trying to get in especially this drone this drone's a survivor man he keeps going in and out like a Vietnamese prostitute <laughs> God. Uh, and you got mad at me for my, for what my reference? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love it. Hey, it's my channel. I can do whatever I want. That was in poor taste. But um, hey. Hey, <laughs> hey, hey, moving hey, right along. Hey, I like tasteless man. Uh, but uh, I really don't agree with his bunker position, uh, or at least the placement. He, he probably should have done it a little more to the right. Uh, Zergling run by is going to be pretty easy with that bunker position. Or if he had just put if, a, uh, uh, if he had Fade just chooses to do so. That's true. He could have also just put a, his barracks right there, and made him run all the way around, so that way the more surface for them to cover around the bunker, so the Marines could get a few more shots off before it did anything. Hey, doing a quick spotter, uh, Overlord. Very good for anti-drops. Unless Blue does the circum circuitous route and goes all the way around the fucking map, because why not? And I'm not even caring about language or anything right now, because I'm tired, damn it. <laughs> back you see the Academy uh, going up for Blue. <laughs> So we're going to see uh, Firebat or Medic play, or probably both, later game. You were saying, Ozzy. <laughs> Sorry about that. As you, uh, I don't know if you guys have been noticing this, about the bunker placement and all of that, even the Sunken Colonies last game, there's been a lot of just people running by the static defenses. Yeah. Like, it's not even a thing. It's like, there was two sunken colonies. It took out, like, one zealot only because the zealots stopped to attack them first. Mm -hmm. That's true. It's just all about how your micro is with this. But he is, but uh, Blue is now getting up the Vulture Hydra, or Vulture Firebat. I don't know why I thought these were freaking... <laughs> Vulture Hydra, Hydra. holy shit! That's OP. <laughs> Vulture, Hydra, Firebat. 
I said it again. Scare me there. Vulture, Firebat, Medic, my god, tongue, work, prox. The scary part of that is, it's actually possible in Brood War because there are Dark Archons. Dark well, Archons. Well, then you'd also get Zealots in there, and that's just even more OP. Also, it would take about 38 million years to develop your, each of the economies to the point where you can get all those things. Exactly. We do have a starport going down for blue, as well as the vulture speed upgrade and the plus one infantry armor. Oh, that marine has just got eaten by spine crawlers. They don't even have mouths, and it just got... Oh, those are sunken colonies. My bad. Again, tired. <laughs> Fucking over. Nerf. Terra needs nerf. nerf. Spire going down for fade. It's about halfway done now. Uh, we probably might see some similar play to what we did last game, whereas, uh, you get, uh, Zerglings and other things in the front of the base while the mutas distract in the back, and you can kind of just run them over. Yep, just steamroll yeah, that... them like a little bitch. You were <laughs> saying, Ozzy? No, I was just saying, like, just like I said last game, you get those mutalists, you get people to move around in places they don't want to go, it's really effective. The medevacs in their or their medics in their over sexualized positions. <laughs> Look at that. She has to whore herself out to two fire bats. I mean, come on. Yes, one medic and two fire bats is very effective. Effective nothing. Upper... That's that's just that's just overtaxing. <laughs> One girl can't be sa can't be expected to satisfy two convicts, man. That's just intense, yo. <laughs> we do have a hydralis den popping for fade, so we might see again those uh, ling lurker and muta play that we did last game. But uh, it doesn't look like uh, blue is ready for this uh, muta play at all. He's only got three marines in those bunkers. The rest of his units attack only ground. And as I say that, here come those mutas, and they're going to do a ton of damage, assuming they can av avoid that bunker. And Wait, again. Fade, fade just back backs right off out. for absolutely no reason. But now that Blue saw that, he's getting his missile turrets up anywhere he really can. And by anywhere, I mean over in the remote club. Nothing is ever going to come, ever. Very true that oh. is. He does have two dropships which aren't doing anything right now and these mutas are going to clean up uh, a lot of these supply depots and just SCVs. He only has, again, three marines out right now. I don't think he can deal with this very effectively. GG! Already! Easy game! Blue. Uh, yeah, I really don't see any way that uh, Blue can come back from this. He's, there's just too much. Unless he does a mass exodus into Fade's base, <laughs> but he's met with three spore col or uh, sunken colonies and quite a few lings. A lurker on the way right now. Never mind, that's a lurker den morphing, so he's going to have a little bit of time before a lurker gets out. But uh, I, I don't see this doing too much damage, especially with that vulture just getting one shot. Oh no, that's just terrible for... That's just terrible, terrible damage on Thede's base. Meat shield these siege tanks are going to do quite a bit, but all these mutas have to do is just come back to clean this up, and that's GG, which Fade is doing right now. He's bringing all these mutas back, and there is nothing to answer them with for Blue Dragon. And Blue is going to GG in two seconds, and Rage Quit, and all Blue's trademark aggression. Trying to exit the SCVs, and they're just going to get liquefied on their way back home. Well, I don't know <laughs> Firebat why just... I'm home. <laughs> Firebat just got liquefied by Mutalisk. And that was pretty hard to do, because that's a glaive worm. That's a parasite. If you get liquefied by a parasite, you're doing something wrong. <laughs> Trying to get the mass marines. All he has to do is just run away from these marines. It's one SCV, zero SCVs, the 25 drones. <laughs> Good job winning the first group or turning, you lucky bastard. Ah, uh, that's, that's blue. That's blue for you. 
Hey everyone, I hope you enjoyed this. I hope you enjoyed me killing myself trying to make this work. <laughs> I'm out. We all out. I'm out. We need sleep. I need sleep. I need... Peace. Food. Peace. Peace. Oh, God.